Do you often crave ice? While it may seem like an odd habit, it could actually be a sign of iron deficiency anemia. About 5 million people in the United States have iron deficiency anemia, and it is one of the most common nutritional disorders worldwide, especially among females. While many of us associate it with symptoms like fatigue and paleness, there are several other signs that we often overlook. So in today's video, let's learn the 10 surprising symptoms of iron deficiency anemia that you shouldn't ignore. At the end of this video, we will also answer some of your frequently asked questions about iron deficiency anemia. So, without any further delay, let's begin with number one. Pika, strange cravings. First on our list of surprising symptoms of iron deficiency anemia is a craving for strange foods or non-food items, such as ice, clay, dirt, chalk, paper, uncooked rice, or dry wheat. This condition is known as pika, an eating disorder characterized by cravings for non-nutritive substances. When the craving is specifically about ice, it is called pagophagia. People with pagophagia usually consume several cups of ice daily. These cravings could arise because the body is trying to soothe mouth discomfort caused by anemia, or because iron deficiency affects brain function, causing unusual cravings. Moreover, chewing ice might offer a temporary sense of relief or alertness for those feeling fatigued due to low iron levels. However, the exact reasons behind these cravings are not fully understood. Generally, pika is harmless, but eating certain items can make it hazardous. So, if you find yourself frequently craving ice or any other non-food items, consult with your healthcare provider or get your iron levels checked. Number two, cold hands and feet. Do your hands and feet often feel cold even when it is not particularly chilly? This could be another sign of iron deficiency anemia. This is because iron is a very essential nutrient for the body. It plays an important role in producing hemoglobin, the protein in red blood cells that carries oxygen from the lungs to the rest of the body. If you do not have enough iron, your body cannot produce enough hemoglobin, which means less oxygen is transported to your tissues. This can result in decreased oxygen supply to extremities like hands and feet, leading to decreased blood flow and lower metabolism in these areas, which can make them feel cold. Number three, paleness. Paleness is one of the most visible signs of iron deficiency anemia, and it is often one of the first things doctors check for when diagnosing iron deficiency anemia. This happens because blood pigment hemoglobin is responsible for giving blood a bright red color. As we have mentioned earlier, hemoglobin relies on iron for its production. So when iron levels are low, hemoglobin production decreases, and this gives rise to paleness. You can observe paleness in areas such as the face, inside the lower eyelids, gums, and nails. And if you notice paleness, consult your healthcare professional. Number four, heart palpitations. Hemoglobin is responsible for transporting blood to the entire body, including the heart. In iron deficiency, there is poor transport of oxygen to body tissues. As a result, heart has to work harder to transport this oxygenated blood to every tissue. This increased stress and workload on the heart gives rise to abnormal murmurs or irregular heartbeats and the sensation that the heart is pounding or racing. This condition is typically known as heart palpitations. In severe cases of iron deficiency anemia, cardiovascular complications like enlarged heart murmurs or even heart failure can occur due to stress in the heart. Number five, restless leg syndrome. Restless leg syndrome is characterized by symptoms such as an uncontrollable urge to move your legs or unpleasant sensations in the legs like tingling, itching, and crawling, especially at night. According to a study, iron deficiency anemia can be significantly linked to restless leg syndrome. This is because iron is essential for many body activities, including creating dopamine, a neurotransmitter that regulates movement. Low iron levels can affect dopamine synthesis resulting in RLS-related symptoms. Restless leg syndrome can be irritating as it disrupts sleep. Therefore, if you suffer from RLS, addressing iron levels through dietary changes, supplements, and medical guidance can help you improve your overall quality of life. Number six, brittle nails. If your nails break easily or are unusually thin, you might be experiencing brittle nails, an important symptom of iron deficiency anemia. Nails are composed of a protein called keratin, 
and low iron levels can disrupt the normal production and maintenance of keratin, making nails weaker and more prone to brittleness. Inadequate iron can also affect the health of the nail matrix, the cells located in the nail bed responsible for producing healthy nail cells. This disruption contributes to fragile, damaged nails. A specific condition related to this is coilonychia, or spoon-shaped nails, where nails become concave or scoop-like. Moreover, iron deficiency affects the delivery of essential nutrients and oxygen to the nails, causing them to become weak, thin, and susceptible to breaking or splitting. Since iron is crucial for producing hemoglobin, which carries oxygen throughout the body, low iron levels force the body to prioritize more critical functions over nail health. Addressing iron deficiency through dietary changes or supplements can help you restore nail strength and overall health. Number 7. Hair Loss Hair loss can be a distressing issue, and one often overlooked cause is iron deficiency anemia. Hair grows in cycles. The antigen, growth phase, catagen, transitional phase, and telogen, resting phase. When iron levels are low, more hair follicles may prematurely enter the telogen phase, resulting in increased hair shedding and thinning. Chronic iron deficiency also places extra stress on the body, which can exacerbate hair loss. This stress contributes to excessive shedding and may lead to noticeable bald patches. While iron supplements can help address the deficiency and potentially reduce hair loss, it is important to consult a healthcare provider to get a specified treatment and iron supplement according to your body's needs. Number 8. Shortness of breath. Do you notice that you get out of breath by climbing steps or by walking a little faster? While this can be completely normal if you are a little bulky, shortness of breath can be another alarming sign of iron deficiency anemia. As we have mentioned earlier, iron is crucial for producing hemoglobin, the protein in red blood cells that carries oxygen throughout your body. When you have iron deficiency anemia, your body does not produce enough hemoglobin, leading to decreased oxygen delivery to tissues. This lack of oxygen can strain your respiratory system, making you feel short of breath, even during activities that didn't previously cause discomfort. In severe cases, it might affect your ability to perform everyday tasks and lead to a feeling of breathlessness at rest. Number 9. Fatigue. Feeling unusually tired all the time even while doing small everyday tasks? One of the basic symptoms of iron deficiency anemia is fatigue, which significantly impacts everyday life. Due to low iron levels, there is not enough hemoglobin to transport oxygen to tissues. This results in your body working harder to get the oxygen it needs, leaving you feeling drained and lacking in energy. If you're finding yourself constantly exhausted, even after a full night's sleep or a relaxing weekend, then you should immediately get your iron levels assessed. Number 10. Dizziness or lightheadedness. Do you also get dizzy when you stand up suddenly after sitting for prolonged hours? Experiencing frequent dizziness or lightheadedness can be unsettling and might indicate an underlying issue like iron deficiency anemia. This is because, in iron deficiency anemia, the overall blood volume decreases leading to less blood flow to the brain, especially when you are standing after sitting. This is also known as orthostatic hypotension when your brain gets dizzy due to reduced oxygen supply to the brain. Iron deficiency anemia can also impair the body's ability to maintain blood pressure. When blood pressure drops upon standing, it also leads to orthostatic hypotension. So, these are the 10 surprising symptoms of iron deficiency anemia you shouldn't overlook. Now, let's address some of your frequently asked questions. Number 1. How is iron deficiency anemia diagnosed? Blood tests like a complete blood count, hemoglobin levels, hematocrit level, and ferritin, an indicator of iron stores, are recommended to fully diagnose iron deficiency anemia. Number 2. How long does it take to see improvements after starting treatment? Symptoms start to improve after six weeks. However, it takes six months or longer for iron levels to return to normal levels and for ferritin stores to fully replenish. Number 3. Can iron deficiency anemia be prevented? Yes, you can prevent iron deficiency anemia by eating a balanced diet containing proteins, fats, minerals, and vitamins, and maintaining a balanced diet rich in iron. This is especially important for those at higher risk, such as pregnant women, growing children, and individuals with heavy menstrual bleeding. Number 4. 
Are women or men more likely to develop iron deficiency anemia? Women are more likely to develop iron deficiency anemia due to the loss of iron levels during pregnancy, menstrual cycles, and breastfeeding. Therefore, it is recommended for women to have a diet full of iron-rich foods or take iron supplements regularly. Number 5. What are the best iron-rich foods to include in my diet? To boost your iron intake, include foods like red meat, beef, lamb, poultry, chicken, turkey, and seafood, clams, oysters, and sardines. For plant-based options, eat leafy greens, spinach, kale, legumes, beans, lentils, nuts and seeds, pumpkin seeds, cashews, and fortified foods, cereals, bread. Dried fruits like raisins and apricots are also good choices.